update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here on this. Uh, this is the Tiger Financial News Network 11 a.m. market update, Eastern Time, of course. And what we're looking at here is the Dow's come back very nicely. It's down only, only 88 points, uh, 72 points, um, having gone all the way down to uh, 32,474. But successfully, so far, the day is young. It hit the 32,449 uh, level on the second. Bounces right up to the 34,100s. Slumps yesterday, continues that down move today, but did hold with the, with the histogram of the MACD slightly better. That's just a kind of a, just the day is young, but it's a good sign so far. And what we're looking at within that context, we're looking at the S&P also holding, just barely, but also holding the left side low. The low of the 2nd of May was 406.62.41. We went down to 406.7.91, trying to hold there a better candle than it was a little earlier but we need to get to the 42 4200s uh, by tuesday of next week to say phew out of the wood for this particular slide looking at the qqq that's slightly different because the qqqs went below the second of may low of 309.65 went down to 305.11 is turning around trying to make a green candle trying to get back to that key support level there's a trend line slightly declining trend line making maybe a two percent decline trying to get back above it if it can get over 315 by the end of the day that'll be a good sign for the weekend whoo this is very important. IWM, the Russell 2000, not doing very much, made a lower lower left side low, not acting very well at all. Gold is going to be very interesting because gold now is up 11. It's trying to hold the 200-period moving average. It's trying to treat that as some kind of a support, as a springboard. It hasn't yet. We'll be looking at gold at the dollar because the dollar had a new move to an old. Oil, 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 uh, this is a high that is a multi-year high at 104.06. Can it hold there? It is a lay E in the Chapman wave. We're looking also at the T. LT. Can there be some kind of a turnaround today? It hasn't happened yet. It's down $1.13 at 114.22. But the TBT, which is the inverse of the TLT, it's in other words, short the Lehman 20 year Treasury bond ETF, is in leg D with a potential doji candle, but the technicals are still pretty darn strong. You would have to see a change in pace only if it goes from 2701 right now down below 24. Let's look at the VIX for a moment. That VIX index is trading right now at um, uh, trading at 31.88 up 68 uh, if by the end of the day the VIX can go below 30.70 and the market rallies that'll be a really good sign but if it starts to climb back into the 3250s not good have a wonderful weekend see you on Monday Basil Chapman signing in.